So, are you comfortable? Yes, sir, I am comfortable. Okay. Tell me about yourself in five minutes. Sir, my name is Lav Malik, mm -hmm. and sir, I belong from Gohana. It's a town in the district Sonipur, Haryana, sir. Sir, I have passed my tenth class from the Gurukul Nilokedi, which is situated in the Karnal district of Haryana, with eighty-five point two percent marks. And sir, I have passed my class twelfth uh, from the Gurukul Kurukshetra, which is a huge, which is a very nice school. And sir, I have passed with seventy-eight point two percent marks. And then, sir, I am pursuing my B.Sc. Physics honors. I am currently in the Bab Masnad University, Astal Bhavan, Rohtak, sir. And sir, I have chosen the department of B.Sc. Physics. Now, sir, my hobbies are teaching my small brother, doing some household works, and then, sir, uh, solving the Sudoku. And sir, I am very comfortable uh, in uh, making good new friends. And sir, uh, I also feel very nice when I am at home. Since seven years, I am living in the hostel, so I am comfortable with my home. There is no problem at there. And sir. Uh, now uh, currently i am um, uh, going to uh, attend the army interview army technical core interview uh, of 49 ssb sir so you want to be army officer yes sir i would like to be army. uh tell me uh, location of nirokhadi where it is located on my sir uh, if we are talking about the karnal district it, it's a small uh, village in the uh, karnal district of nirokhadi and uh, my gurukul is situated in the uh, fields of the nirokhadi village sir so nirokhadi is in the center of the karnal district in the center of Karnal district of Haryana. Yes, sir. Okay, nice. So this Gurukul, uh, with the director of this Gurukul? Sir, the director of the Gurukul is the uh, Acharya Devraji. He is the governor of the Himachal Pradesh earlier, and now currently he is the governor of the Gujarat state, sir. And sir, uh, here our Gurukul is hundred years old. It's a hundred years old institute. Earlier these were run by Maharishi, sir. Marishis and now it's run by the Acharya Devraji and uh, Colonel, uh, Colonel Arundatta is the principal and director of the Gurukul Kurukshetra sir. What is the medium of education there? Sir, the quality of education is both tra uh, traditional education and modern educations are mixed together and they are provided to the students so that students do not forget their past and uh, they must also remember with the new technologies which is provided in today's world sir. What your Sir, my father is a uh, multi-purpose health worker. He is uh, working in a uh, health department which is situated in our own village, Baswal Kalam. It is approximately 18 km from our hometown. Mother? Sir, my mother is uh, my mother is trying to be a lecturer of the home science. Uh, she is studying still and sir, she has cleared uh, three HTATs and now sir, she is applying for the job. So, Nilokhadi is a Kasba or a village? Sir, it's a uh, Kasba, you, you can say. Kasba, means a small town. Yes, sir. What may be the population of that place? Sir, maybe 30,000 or 40,000. 30 to 40,000? Yes, sir, approximately 40,000. You are not sure? No, I'm not sure, sir. Okay, right. Okay, tell me two, two qualities each of your father and mother which you like. Sir, talking about my father. Sir, my father is a very responsible person and sir, he is very helpful. And including sir, he is very honest also. And sir, my mother, sir, she is very courageous woman and uh, sir she is very determined towards her job and sir towards her family your father is very responsible person yes sir very helpful person yes sir give me example how can you say that he is very helpful sir just before coming in the major culture classes when i was at my home sir there sir we found a small calf of the cow and sir there was infection in his four or four legs Sir, my father brought some medicines. He told me to bring some medicines. We brought some medicines. Sir, we made the bandage there and we helped him uh, putting some cotton and sir, his medicines. And then, sir, all the insects from his legs got out and uh, continuously five days we were treating him. And this was my father's initiative, sir. He also told that your mother is very courageous. Yes, sir. Give me an example. Sir, my mother, uh, sir, uh, we, have, we are three brothers. Sir, my mother take care of our home. She do the uh, home making things and sir, including uh, she also studies and sir, she has qualified the uh, state examination. So sir, this shows that uh, my mother is so much determined and courageous towards. Yes, very determined. Okay, your mother is still studying and applying for the government job. Yes, sir. Okay, it is great. So, what is your number in your siblings? Sir, I am the eldest one. Sir. Eldest one. Yes, sir. Other two, what they are doing? Sir, uh, one is in ninth class mm -hmm. and currently studying in the Gurukul Nilokhedi, mm -hmm. my alumni. And sir, one is in third class and he is studying in a school in our Gohana town only, Jawaharlal Nehru Public School, sir. Now, because you have passed out from that school, yes, sir. studying in first year, no? Yes, sir. Where? Sir, I am studying in the Bhav Masnad University mm -hmm. and in the B.Sc. Physics Honours Department, sir. 
Where it is? So it is in Rohtak, which is 31 kilometers from our hometown, sir. So you go to your college daily? Uh, yeah, sir. you stay there at... Uh, sir, actually currently the classes are not going on. Mm. These will start in the few few uh, months like, sir, December or January, mm. mid-January. And sir, NCC classes, were, I have taken some NCC classes there. Like we have also taken the Punit Sagra Bhyan near the Tilyar Lake which was there. Mm. And sir, we have also cleaned the place and sir, some of the NCC training we have attended. Mm. Uh, this much is only uh, from the universities going at this time, sir. Okay, now coming to your school again. So, mix of traditional and modern education is given there. Yes, sir. Okay. So, in traditional, what you have learned? Sir, like we used to perform Havana every day or sir, sometimes weekly when the complete exams are near or sir, when sir, exams are near. And sir, uh, we do Yajapavit Sanskar there. And sir, uh, in, uh, we uh, sit in the mess. Uh, our, in our mess, there is no table and chairs. We sit on the floor. We put the tart patti there. And then sir, we sit. We, send, uh, we perform the rituals of the uh, uh, Bhojnaya Mantra. And then sir, we uh, eat our food. And uh, we also do Sandhya Havans. These are the things which is given to us. Sandhya Havan, it is done daily? Yes, sir. Okay. So you must be reciting Gayatri uh, mantra daily? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, nice. In modern education, you are taught all math, physics and all science. And sir, some competitive exams like we have special wings for NDA and IIT. Yeah. And sir, I was in NDA wing there. You were in NDA wing? Yes, sir. Because you wanted to be military officer? Yes, sir, I wanted to. Okay, nice. So, uh, let's talk about your teachers. Some teachers are very favorite, some are just so-so. Yes, sir. What was the teacher's attitude towards you? Sir, every teacher was well, uh, they were very well behaving in our classes. And sir, they were teaching with their full uh, energy and with their full passion, sir. And sir, uh, all my teachers were very good. They were very cooperative also. And sir, whenever we get doubts, they stay for us. They, when our exams come near, like board exams, when came near, said they used to come at uh, 10 o'clock at night also. And sometimes some teachers stayed in our hostels with the, in our rooms also for the completion of the doubts of the students. And sir, they are very cooperative. Was there any teacher who didn't like you? No, sir. Actually, there was no any teacher who didn't like me. Was there any teacher whom yourself didn't like? Sir, actually, I like all the teachers. But sir, actually I was not uh, so much strong in the organic chemistry. Mm. So sir, uh, I uh, I like every teacher, but sir, I was not strong in organic chemistry. So uh, there was sometimes I uh, didn't like the chemistry teacher <laughs> because there is... Okay, okay. It is a bit dry subject. Yes, sir. It's okay, very... Nice. So what has been your favorite subject in class 12? Sir, it was physics, sir. Physics? Yes, sir. Define Ohm's law? Sir, Ohm's law is uh, defined as the voltage which is directly proportional to the uh, current in a wire and the resistance which stops the and inversely proportional and uh, direct V is equal to I R. So its form is given in this manner mm -hmm. and it is it says that the voltage is directly proportional to current flowing in the wire uh, by proportional into the resistance provided in the uh, wire, sir. There are certain conditions, no? Yes, sir. There are certain conditions like the uh, length in the area and sir the resistivity should remain the constant at the temperature sir temperature sir. diameter of the wire material of the wire yes sir temperature yes sir plus pressure in the room that uh, actually ohm's law is true in uh, actually laboratory conditions yes sir okay yes, sir. Uh, the temperature pressure sh should remain the same at the when the ohms law is followed mm -hmm. otherwise sir, if we'll uh, just open everything and we will not uh, put the vacuum situations there then sir, this will not be followed okay okay yes. so why uh, you know writing from 20 to 120 how many times you write zeros writing from 20 to 120 Yes, sir. 20, 21, 22, like this. Yes, you write up to 120. How many times you write zeros? Uh, sir, may I take a few seconds? Yes, yes. Sir, uh, 11, sir. 11 times? Yes, sir. Just make me understand how sir. it is. Sir, 20, oh. sir, 20 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and then 102, mm. and then 710, and uh, so 12, sir. 12, zero. 12, zero, sir. Now look, look at that again. I think it is wrong answer. Sir, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 
30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 2 and then sir, 110 and then 120 sir between 100 and 110 don't you write other zeros uh, yeah we write sir you write nine more zeros nine more zeros sir so total number of zeros you write is 21 21 zeros okay anyway it was not a math question yes sir. okay it was very simple question just how much focusing you are on the questions we focus more bit on questions okay yes sir. <coughs> right so now tell me about your friends how many uh, friends you might have in your general friend circle sir approximately 20 friends 20 friends okay yes. how many best friends you have sir i have two best friends two be best friends tell me their names sir one is himanshu khatri and one is arun chauhan sir first is himanshu khatri sir himanshu khatri yes sir. which place he belongs to sir he belongs from gohana only gohana what is his father's yes, name sir, his father's name is satpal khatri sir and what is his profession sir uh, currently is pursuing MBBS from a Pune, there is a university and sir, further he is going to the Philippines country for his further education. What is his father's profession? His father is a property dealer sir. Property dealer. Yes, sir. So, Himansu, how many brothers and sisters he has? Sir, he has one sister only sir. Okay, tell me his two qualities which you liked, sir, due Himansu, to which he became your fast friend. Sir, he is very humorous and sir, he is very cooperative. Very humorous and very cooperative. Yes sir. Okay. And second friend is? Sir, he is Arun Chauhan. Arun Chauhan. Uh, he also belongs to Nilokhiri? No, sir. Uh, yes, sir. He was there with me in Nilokhiri. And then, sir, he was also with me in the Gurukul Kruchetra. For, uh, we were continuously with uh, for three years. And, sir, he is from Palwal district of Haryana, sir. Palwal district of Haryana. Yes, sir. Palwal means south side of Delhi. Yes, sir. Okay. Tell me his two qualities for which you liked him. He became your very close friend. Sir, he is very courageous and sir, he is a determined person. Courageous and determined person? Yes, sir. How much percentage he got in class 12? Sir, 92%. 92. Yes, sir. Give me example, how he is courageous? Sir, like when we were preparing for the G2 task, mm -hmm. sir, there was a Burma bridge there. Mm -hmm. And sir, when our Subedar Balwan sir told us that somebody come and take initiative and show the whole class that how it is to be done. So, sir, he was the only one who has taken out his hands from 56 students and he showed them because it was uh, so at so much height there and everybody was fearing from doing the things. So, sir, he uh, take the initiative. This shows his courage. And, sir, he is very hardworking also because, sir, he prepares himself for his studies as well as for his games properly, sir. Asha, whenever you are at home, yes, are you able to help your father or mother in any manner? Yes, sir. I used to help my father and mother. Sir. As what? Like, sir, my father prepared some slides for the malaria test. So, sir, my father also taught me how to do it. And, sir, I helped my father in that older situations, making, helping him some uh, document verifications like. And, sir, my mother in doing the moving things like home cleaning and, sir, uh, like cook, sometimes cooking food also. And then my mother and me studied together, sir. Uh, you really help your mother in cooking? Yes, sir. Sometimes I help, sir. Have you learned something? Uh, actually, sir, I used to just make give her some items from brought from upside of the kitchen, which is because our kitchen is a little bit large, and so we have some of the uh, some of the boxes putting up upon the shelf. So, sir, I give her some. No, no. I am asking about cooking. Yes, you can cook something? No, sir. I don't cook. Don't know. You have not learned? No, sir. But sir, you know, is clear? Sir, actually, I don't, uh, means I don't get time and even she says me that uh, you must not come here. You just help me and go and just do your study. Otherwise, sir, I help you are moving and cleaning the floors and sir, setting up the home salmiras and then sir, preparing the home very well and the guest room especially, sir. How is your bonding with your uh, siblings? Sir, I am my bonding very strong. It is formal or friendly or just so-so? So it's friendly, sir. I am friendly with my uh, brother, both of my brothers. Mm -hmm. Because sir, I want my brother to tell me each and everything what's happening with him so that I can help him in the... He obeys you? Yes sir, he obeys me. If he doesn't obey sometimes, then no. do you scold him or slap him? No sir, I generally ask him what's the matter, that why you're not following me this time, that what has happened with you, what's the problem, then sir, he tell me each and everything that yeah, this is the problem and please help me, then sir, I help him. Okay, nice. Okay, when you are at home all, all siblings at home, father, mother also, studies are not going on, there is no job at home, no work at home, 
just sitting, then generally what is the topic of the talks? Like some, our father asked us that, uh, my father asked us that uh, what's your, uh, what's going on in your studies and uh, tell me something that uh, are you feeling comfortable at home because sir I used to live in seven, uh, seven years continuously in hostel. So sir, in, uh, starting I was not so much comfortable because I was in the so many company of my friends and it, I didn't go to any friend there. So sir, and uh, generally my father and we uh, all sit together and then sir, we play some ludo sometimes and sometimes carom boards also. And then sir, we, we uh, watch a series on the uh, TV sometimes for relaxation. And sir, general talks are like this only that my father asks us by what's your study is going on and uh, how do you comfortable here. And you are closer to mother or father? Sir, I am closer to my mother, sir. Closer to mother. Yes, sir. Why? Your father is cold sometimes? No, sir. Yes, sir. Sometimes he's cold when I was small, like uh, he taught me many things. Mm -hmm. But sir, I'm closer to both. But, uh, but sir, my strongest bond is with my mother, sir. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, in your school, uh, what games you played? Sir, I played handball for con con uh, continuously three years. Mm -hmm. Then, sir, I also played volleyball in my 11th and 12th. And I was also a 400 meter champion, sir. You took part in some competitions also? Yes, sir. What what competitions? Like sir, debate competition I took part. Mm -hmm. I took part in the Vogda talk program there, uh, in symposiums and sir, quizzes, uh, that much. Sir. Handball, mein, what is the width of the volleyball, uh, what is the width of the uh, field, handball field, width and length? Sir, 40 meter is the length and 20 meter is the width. Sir. 20 to 40 meter? Yes. Sir. Okay. Can you tell me what is the width of the uh, goal post? Yes, sir. It is approximately 7 foot, sir. Approx 7 feet? Yes, sir. And other than this handball, you told that you play some other games also? Sir, volleyball I played for enjoyment okay. and uh, 400 meter relay I played, sir. Okay. Now, because you have left the, left the school, yes, do you play anything? Haryana, mein mostly people you know play Kusti and by, uh, Kabaddi. Yes, sir. Uh, have you ever played Kabaddi? Yes, sir. I have played Kabaddi with my friends in the local in our local hometown, Gohana, mm -hmm. sometimes. But sir, actually now all the friends are settling outside and they are uh, in higher eldest than me. So, sir, I don't find uh, so much of companies there. And Himanshu is also going outside. So, sir, I generally practice for my racing. And sir, when I used to go in Kabaddi, there are big names in Haryana. You know, most of the Kabaddi players they come from Haryana. Yes, sir. Can you tell me some big names in Kabaddi? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Sir Sandeep Malik and sir uh, is uh, Pradeep Narwal, sir. Right. They are from Haryana? Yes, sir. Good. Do you watch television? Yes, sir. I do watch television. What type of programs you like? Sir, I like the cricket match. I see sometimes on DD Sports, like it was T20 World Cup was going on there. Mm -hmm. I watch some of the India matches. Then, sir, our full family watch CID serials sometimes it comes. And then, sir, I used to watch uh, the Aztec news with my father sometimes. Uh, that much only I do, sir. Abhi, T20 World Cup was going on, no? Yes, sir. Where it was held? Sir, it was held at many places. Like, first it was held in uh, in India, also it was held. So in Australia, it also, it also it was held. So, who took up, took up that, you know, World Cup? Sir, England, sir. England defeated which country? Uh, England defeated, sir, Pakistan. Pakistan? Yes, sir. Okay. Okay. Uh, New Zealand. No, no. India defeated Pakistan. Pakistan. That is correct. Pakistan. Okay, nice. So, you watch CID serial on this. Have you ever watched, uh, you know, films or cartoons? Yes, sir. Uh, I do watch sometimes films like when my smaller brother is watching films. Uh, sometimes I watch it, sir. Cartoon? No, sir. Cartoons you, you don't watch. No, okay, right. During COVID period, is your school must have been closed? Yes, sir. So you stayed at home, no? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. So two serials were coming, yes, Ramayana sir. and Mahabharat. Yes, sir. Which serial you liked? Sir, I liked Mahabharat, sir. Mahabharat. Yes, sir. Why you liked Mahabharat? Because, sir, uh, generally the things which I see in Mahabharat, they are also implemented in, in today's world also. And sir, I find very good characters in Mahabharat, like sir, Bhishma Pitama is there, Arjuna is there, Krishna is there, and sir, they all five Pandavas. Sir, each of them are very good qualities and uh, shown very in a very proper manner as it is written in the Gita and sir, as it is mentioned in the Mahabharata book, sir. Who is your favorite character in Mahabharat? Sir, he is Bhishma Pitama, sir. So, he is favorite for what? Sir, I like his personality. Mm -hmm. Sir, he is a Brahmachari, first of all. 
and then sir uh, he obeys his elders and sir he taught his his sons means not his real sons but sir he considered arjuna and his all the five brothers as his son he taught them very well and sir is a very determined person towards his goal that he has to follow brahmacharya full his, his full life and sir uh, also is very cooperative with his no yeah, but something is coming you know he like brahmachari bhishma yes sir and sir he is also patriotic person sir. do you like to be brahmachari like bhishma yes sir he want to be brahmachari like this no sir but i but sure. i follow brahmacharya sir okay. it is told okay. in our gurukul okay you like that yes sir. attitude okay so now i doubt have you girlfriend no sir i don't have any girlfriend do you want to remain brahmachari so you don't have a girl no sir why don't you have girlfriend i didn't go time sir actually sir from 7 years i am studying in the boys hostel and sir after that it has only passed 3 uh, to 4 months i have come from my hostel sir so sir i didn't even get time to meet some but sir i have many friends who are girls like sir when i used to study for the end examination and sir now here i am so there are some girls who are my friends sir uh, when you were in class 10 did you fill up the form for j mains and all yes sir class uh, 12 sir i filled up So you filled up. You appeared for the main. Yes, sir. You got some respectable rank or not? Yes, sir. I got, sir. Hmm. It was approximately two lakh fifty-five thousand. Hmm. And sir, sixty-nine point seven. So have you applied for TES also? Yes, sir. I applied for TES. And this is for NDA or TES? Sir, this is for TES, sir. So it's for TES. Yes. Sir. Okay. So finally, you were going to be selected, going to be engineer in army. Yes, sir. Isn't it? Yes, sir. Okay. Now, okay, be a little bit alert. So, who taught you Hindi in class ten? Who was your favorite teacher in class twelve? What was the name of the principal when you left the school? How many districts are there in Haryana? Who is governor of Haryana? Do you like your chief minister? Then tell me who is national security advisor of India. Who is CDS? What is the highest rank in army? Who is chief of army staff? How many commands are there in army? And name some war fighting equipments of Indian army. Sir, my teacher of Hindi was Mr. Rajesh sir. He was very good teacher. And sir, class twelfth, my favorite subject was physics, and I was taught physics by Vishal sir, ma sir. He is also very good teacher. Sir, our principal of the Gurukul Kurukshetra was Karl Arundhati sir. he is also very uh, good uh, patriotic person and he is also very good director he is a director and principal of the gurugul kshetra sir sir uh, the governor of the uh, haryana is uh, is from the karnataka district telangana district and his name is uh, sri uh, so sir i don't remember proper name because pronunciation is somewhere and sir i like my chief minister sir he uh, he made many good schemes for the haryana Gaur, haryana state and sir he has also play, uh, put focus on the thing Uh, along edu- with education sir with education and sports he has put the schemes there sir the highest rank in the indian army is the ge- general and honorary rank is field marshal sir sir the cds is uh, uh, cds is lieutenant general anil chohan currently sir do you think uh, cds can be lieutenant general no sir sorry he is he is a uh, he was lieutenant general when he retired retired sir. but now he is cds no yes sir sorry he is he is a general he is a general sir sir he is anil chohan and sir uh, the uh, education minister of uh, education minister of india i, I don't remember sir uh, national security national security advisor is ajit dowal he is a national security advisor and sir uh, including that he has made many good uh, uh, strategies for the some uh, wars etc things and sir the equipments which is used in army are uh, some fighting equipments are sir artillery firings the uh, machine guns uh, simple assault rifles and some uh, b- bombs uh, uh, then sir thus there are seven commands in the indian army they are sir uh, okay okay my rank is wing commander in air force what is my equivalent rank in army sir it's lieutenant colonel sir lieutenant colonel yes Okay. Your father was not in army. Yes, sir. Your grandfather? No, sir. Your maternal grandfather? Sorry, sir, I don't know. Okay. Why you want to become army officer? Sir, because from the class 10th onwards, I was just thinking to go in the NDA in the armed forces. And sir, I find there is a good respect given to armed force personnel. And sir, there is a continuously growth development. Sir, there is a huge difference between the jo- uh, job. 
others and the sir, armed forces it's a not just job sir i consider it as a life adventures uh, life adventures thing so it provides a good respect there's a good growth development in there so in other jobs we only find that some people sit on the offices and just work sir they get respect they earn money but sir they lose their physics some physical uh, exercises sometimes sir they lose their mental health but in our for personal we find still when they are retired they are still active sir they are uh, adventurous sir they like each, each and everything they are helpful to everyone sir by seeing this the prosperity and respect given to our force officers sir i want to join our indian army as a lieutenant sir do you hope you can be selected yes sir okay you are going somewhere in a train sitting in a general compartment you have some 5000 rupees with you yes sir suddenly you know a person with gun comes in there it generally happens in up bihar madhya pradesh yes sir so he declares that okay hand over me your purse yes sir then give yes sir otherwise you open fire yes sir yes sir so he puts his gun on the chest of him passenger yes, he hands over his money power yes, purse to him then he moves to the next one he came to you put his gun on your chest what will you do sir first of all i'll hand over all the money to him and sir as soon as when i will get chance i'll directly uh, grab on him and i'll catch the uh, gun and within uh, few seconds all the passengers will come and will catch him sir we will hand over him to the uh, uh, train crpf police standing there on the maybe next station or maybe next to next station and i will write a written complaint and i'll provide to a uh, and the railway department suppose there are two one is taking money like this another is holding a rifle yes, and by putting his back to the rail wall yes, the train wall yes sir he is keeping a watch in that case what will do sir first of all we will hand over the money to him sir when they will left the train then sir we will inform the railway department on the next station because sir we cannot take a risk at that time because there are some passengers sir we can grab one but sir we do not uh, take the guarantee of that somebody else will uh, take initiative and grab the other one sir have you done anything up to this time for which you feel proud of yourself yes sir sir i motivated my juniors sir i i am very responsible sir i uh, always teach my brothers which is a very huge responsibility because sir they are sm- two small brothers i teach them every time so the good lessons of the life sir i followed my parents their advices and sir including that i have also uh, i was also senior most cadet of my indian wing sir they are uh, being given the respect of the as uh, i was teaching my juniors and sir i am uh, i also done very good things like sir i plant trees generally on my birthday on my father on my mother birthday and sir these all things we have done and i am feeling very proud of these things anything up to this time for for which you repent or for which uh, you feel ashamed of yourself no sir i don't have any these things uh, but i feel ashamed but sir i feel sometimes uncomfortable when i used to remember my plus 2 marks because sir, during the mat examination i was not feeling so well i was sir i was having fever so i was unable to attempt my exam very well just this is the thing which i feel otherwise sir i am very happy with my life with my personal okay thank you thank you.